Hey everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome. I want to address a serious issue that's going on with Etsy and actually trying to connect a print on demand partner. And here's the problem. A lot of people are running into an error trying to add their location for their print on demand provider. And in this video, I am going to show you how to fix that. So let's just dive right on into my computer so we can make this short, sweet, and simple. So here we are in my Design Diva shop. And as you can see, I have no production partners uh, attached to this shop. So what you will want to do, how you get to this area is by you going to settings and going to production partner. And then that's how we get here. Now this is where you will add your print on demand provider such as Printify. That is my go-to print on demand provider for one of my other shops. So what we'll do is go in here and click add partner. Now, of course, you need to put the name of the Printify partner that you are going to be shipping your goods from. So in a previous tutorial video, I created a notebook and in that notebook, that notebook was being printed by a uh, spoke. So it's called spoke custom products. Okay. That's the name of the supplier inside of Printify that is going to be shipping out those notebooks. And that is what. Uh, the information you have to put here. And then of course it says, show this production partner's name to buyers. No, I don't want to show the name to buyers, but I do want the buyers to know that it is a print shop. And then it asks for the city, state, and country. Well, uh, spoke is in Norcross, Georgia in the United States. Okay. And then it says, please describe your partner. So a printing partner for my a uh, shop period and then it's going to ask some questions why are you working with this partner because i don't have all the equipment i don't print notebooks up and ship them out right and what is my role in the design process i design everything myself pretty much and what is this partner's role in the production process so they make components of my product so i make the design they create the actual um notebook and everything but and ship it, but I pretty much do the rest. So then it says save partner. Now, when I'm trying to save the partner, like most other Etsy uh, store owners, they're trying to save the partner and it keeps telling you that the location is inaccurate. So, you know, in order to open up an Etsy shop, you got to have at least one active listing anyway, whether that's a dummy listing or not. And that's what you're going to have to use because this is not going to work. No way, no how, because typically when you start typing the location, it's supposed to be a drop down. Okay. So the workaround is you cancel out of this thing here, just get out of it. Now you go over to your listings. You might have one listing available in the shop. So you just go over to your listings. And then what you do is you highlight one of the listings. It might be your only listing, but just highlight one of them. Then go up to where it says editing options, go to change production partner, and then you're going to add the partner here. So then we're going to put spoke. So we're going to put the same information we did before, and we're going to turn this off. We're going to put a print shop. Now we're going to start typing in. Now, as you can see, it's starting to work. And then we click it, the printer for my shop. And then you answer the questions and you press save partner. Now I'm not going to add this partner on here. <laughs> I'm not going to do that. But if I wanted to add the partner, I would just click here and then update and add the partner. Okay. So now you can go back in all of your listings and actually you have this, um, production, uh, partner in there already. So this is the workaround. This is how you get your production partner added. And then you add it to the necessary products that take that this uh, production partner take care of. Okay. So that's how you're going to have to add them as of right now at the time of this recording, because Etsy for some reason is, um, not letting it go through on the back end. Okay. So this is the workaround that's going to help you um, add your production partner in to Etsy so that way they can fulfill your orders. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel um, so I can produce more videos and tutorials and all of those good things that help you. So until the next video.
Bye.